We're here at the uh, historic and beautiful old, uh, old Post Office Pavilion in El Centro, celebrating the, the beauty of the Mexican culture through the uh, Dia de los Muertos celebration. It's a celebration that celebrates life, celebrates our ancestors. This place is absolutely beautiful with the decorations in the altar and the events that are happening today from face painting, poem readings, folklorical dancers. You know, these, these types of events are very important because they're very educational. Um, it helps, you know, people understand what does Dia de los Muertos mean? Um, you know, how do you celebrate? It, it just gives an awareness of, you know, the valuable um, events like this provide um, to, to the community. This is our fourth year, uh, four years ago, to the city of El Centro, who I greatly appreciate for allowing me to actually um, hold this event, bring all these artifacts, all this information, create the altar, which is a very important element of Dia de los Muertos. It's to educate the community, um, to show them um, the teachings of Dia de los Muertos, the heritage of the Mexican culture, also uh, to also let them know that um, the meaning of Dia de los Muertos. So this is an example of something that the city of El Centro is doing for our community to bring culture, to bring celebration, to do, to have things to do in El Centro. It gives us an opportunity to always uh, make sure that we never forget them and so it is a very important day. Um, obviously for me as a Mexican it is very very important to celebrate Dia de los Muertos. It's pretty much to remember your loved ones, to also celebrate with them, to always keep them in mind, uh, to take the time to create their altar. On altars you want to put their picture, you want to put their favorite foods, what they enjoyed, and this is a time to just celebrate with your family.